have to uh, drop the goblins and the archers. And the archers are going the wrong way. Why? You guys are the smartest. You must have a 4.0 in school, for sure. Hey, what's going on, you guys? It is John Hallett, 168 here, and today we are back on Nation with another episode of the Magical Let's Play series. It's magical, and I'll explain to you why it's magical in just a moment. Um, but the reason I'm doing it is because, you know, I've just had a little bit of nostalgia. Some little, like, sadness. I haven't had the Let's Play series in my life for a little bit, so I had to bring it back. And we do, indeed, we can do some things with the Let's Play series. The Barb King is not the only thing we have left um, to finish, uh, maxing out our Town Hall 7. What we got to do is we got some things in the laboratory We got our that are not Dark Elixir related. We have uh, the Rage Spell and the uh, Heal Spell. So we got to work on those puppies, getting them up there. Um, I kind of want to go for the Heal Spell today just because it costs more, uh, and I'm closer to that. Um... I know. I have a million elixir, so why don't we go for that? Why not? Um, also, uh, we got to get our traps and we got our collectors and mines. We got to get them up to level 11. So it's going to be crazy. We got some things to do here today. Let's get on it. But before we get started, I got to tell you why the there's there's a lot of magic happening in the in the Clash Forest. Because if you just look at those leaves, they're like the most realistic leaves I've ever seen. They're like clumps of green. There's, it's amazing. I, the detail is beyond me. Um, but also, if we take a look at the builder, I have a few questions for him. Like, first off, how are you sleeping with a, a hammer on your on your chest, like, on your stomach? Like, how is that possible? And also, if you guys ever noticed when you're, like, when the builder's building something, he never brings any, like, supplies with him. So, like, when you're upgrading your town hall and it changes, like, shape and everything, it gets bigger, has some, I don't know, like, a different chimney or something. Like, how does, there's no supplies. He doesn't bring any supplies with him. So, I've concluded that it's got to be the hammer. There's something in the hammer that is just magical because you can, you can sleep with it on you. The, the, it looks like a massive hammer. If you guys look at it, it's, like, huge. Um... Like in comparison to his body, like that's a large hammer. Um, so it's got to be something with the hammer because if you hit a building enough with it, it's got to change. It changes into another type of building, a better type of building. So we gotta learn. We gotta learn from the builder about its hammer. We're gonna be on a quest for the uh, the hammer of the builder. That's it's like more valuable than Thor's hammer. I kid you not. Um, so all right, guys, let's go ahead, look for the hammer, and get into those awesome raids. Oh, hello! Here we go! It is the name I cannot pronounce from the clan Ichi. Ichi. Wonderful! Alright, let's go ahead and look at those collectors. They are so freaking full. I love seeing those collectors when they're full. They're just, it's like a work of art. I cry every time in a good way, in a joyful way. Alright, look! Oh, the skeletons! Oh, goodness! Two skeletons! Oh, I don't I guess we'll just have to surrender, guys. Those are too many for us to take out. Oh, just kidding. Um... Let's see if there's any Teslas over here. You guys call it. I think there's going to be Teslas. I'm going to call a Tesla. No. Big bomb. Big bomb over here. No. Maybe. Yes. No. No. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Um, but we want to get the loot. We're all about the loot. Loot, 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 loot. Get those goblins. They know where it's at. Grab that loot. Grab it, boys. Grab them, grab them, grab them. Okay. Very good. Uh, now, the hard part is going to be getting into these guys over here because they are kind of through those walls and these guys over here. So, um, let's start by going over here. Let's start by doing this sort of thing. Drop a few Wally Breakers. Open that up. You know, that's the way it goes. Uh, we need to drop one, two more. I'm going to drop two more. There they go. Opening things up. Wonderful. Uh, let's throw some goblins in there to grab that elixir. And uh, that should be good. Oh, uh, no. We need a little more. A little more. A little more help. A little more help from the homies. Uh, all right. Let's see. This is kind of using a lot of troops. So we don't want to use too many more on this area. We have a lightning spell. Worst comes to worst, we can use the lightning spell. Uh, these guys interesting because he has his defenses on the outside. I'm like, dude, what are you doing? Is there any clan castle? Thank the Lord. <laughs> there we go. Um, let's go ahead and uh, maybe we should push in the back a little bit. I think like the back's going to be easier to get into. So let's drop our barbarian cover here. Archers up behind and some wall breakers to get through those walls. That's what's up. Grab them. Get them open. We're going to drop those other two just to get this going open. Perfect. There they go. Now we can open up those two compartments there. Drop our goblins. Get some get some action happening. Let's get some action happening with our goblins. There we go. Take them out. Very good. Very good. Uh, we just have this one to worry about. And there's this one over here. Like, dude, what are you doing over there? Why did you choose to live over there? What's your problem? Um, okay, we got some guys over here. 
Some guys over here. Come on, boys. Come on. Let's get them. Let's get them. Let's get them. All right. Come on. Come on. Grab that. Grab that. Grab that. Grab it. Just grab it. I don't even know what it is, but get it. Very good. Very good. Very good. Uh, we've gotten, like, most of the elixir. There's, like, one more elixir collector there. That's going to be a pain to get to because there's, like, now that there's four mortars, it's, like, death to farming. My goodness, it's crazy. Uh, we might have to drop the king on a adventure to get these two right here. I think we should do that. Here they come. Oh, no, that's not the king. <laughs> but where would the king go? Let's drop a barbarian. The king would go over there. So maybe he can draw all the attention over there while I can throw some archers down to get these guys. So let's see if we can do that. Let's go. Let's make it happen, boys. Here they go. Um, the archers the archers are kind of going over there too, but they aren't at the same time. What's going on? Here they go. Oh my gosh. The king's doing something. He's he's not really distracting anymore. What the deuce? What are you doing, king? Uh, all right. Now they're going for... Oh no! We're out of time! Oh my gosh. Well, we got 100,000 elixir. Didn't get that much gold though. So we're going to have to go on a bit of a redeeming raid coming up here, guys. You know where it's at. We're going to train up our gab strategy, and we will be on to the next raid up next up now let's go all right you guys we've got a redemption here we got some redemption happening we got the canvas the canvas what is the canvas I don't know it could be a painting canvas it could be canvas the app you never know it's gonna be crazy okay guys uh, look at that loot it's in the collectors I'm pretty dang sure look how full they are let's get on it um, let's drop some barbarians let's drop our archer cover right behind taking out all of that beautiful loot oh my gosh I just love it when you find these inactive bases they are the best they're absolutely the best that is the definition of loot um, these are the bomb alright and normally they don't have that many traps and stuff because they're inactive and it's just it's just a wonderful find in the clash forest when you're venturing for this long through the jungle the clash jungle and the clash forest it's like such a great relief to find something so great um, alright let's go ahead and uh, let's finish him off on the side here get the archers happening we got a lot of archers this raid um, there they come there they again they're getting it they're gonna get that money get it get it Woo! let's go um, okay they've gotten uh, most of them let's drop some goblins to take out this um, how much is left we got like a hundred thousand about just about a hundred thousand uh, eighty thousand eighty seven eighty six thousand eighty five thousand gold left in the center there let's see if we can break in it's gonna be a bit of a challenge um, but I think we might be able to do it. Um, I'd break in from the top, though. That's what I'd do. That's what I'd do, and that's what we're gonna do. So let's try it out here. We're gonna get our guys happening. Go break break through there. Wall breakers, you got it. You got this. Get them open. Perfect. Um, I'm gonna drop the king there. The king's going for the mortar. Perfect. That's what we need. Get the king. Get it. Get it out. Take it out. Take it out. Take that. Take that freaking mortar out. We don't like it. Very good. Let's drop the le rest of the wall breakers heading into the center of the base there. Oh no, that the wall breakers aren't going to the center. Why aren't you going to the center? What the deuce is wrong with you? Okay. Um, we're just gonna have to uh, drop the goblins and the archers. And the archers are going the wrong way. Why? You guys are the smartest. You must have a 4.0 in school, for sure. Um, we're going to get... The goblins are in. The goblins got in. They broke in. Oh, my goodness. This is wonderful. Okay, so we're going to drop the rest of the goblins. We're going to drop some archers here uh, to take out the town hall. Uh, I, even though we got the win. Uh, but they aren't going to go for the loot because they ain't smart enough to go for the loot. The goblins are the real ones who got the 4.0. They know what's up. Uh, maybe, maybe the archers will get a little bit of it here. We got this one archer on the outside who's actually gonna take out this gold storage which is actually amazing and i don't think it's in range of anything so ha ha yes go no no dang it okay <laughs> never mind about that let's since we have a lightning spell let's just uh let's just go like this for fun Woo! grab that loot that's what's up and bam that is gonna wrap it up for today on the let's play let's go ahead and upgrade some stuff back at home back at the base um so what should we upgrade i think we have enough to upgrade our healing spell up to level four there we go that is what's up we got it happening very good in the builder let's upgrade our builder's hut to level zero no just kidding that wasn't funny okay anyways um what else can we do we got a bunch of gold so let's start the process of getting the elixir Ooh, not that getting the elixir collectors up to level 11 let's start upgrading uh four of them let's upgrade four of them to level 11 come on bro come on homie 
grab that elixir awesome we are on our way up to that maxed out town hall seven thank you guys so much for joining me on the journey be sure to hit the like button below see if we can smash 100 likes and i can't wait to see you guys next time yeah.